So yes, I was in um, Lidl and I saw this. I already have the dishwasher one and I haven't used it yet. I might do the dishwasher one now as well. I got this on Amazon. I probably got charged more than I should offer it because these kind of things on Amazon you sometimes get ripped off for. But anyway, this is the dishwasher one that I actually meant to buy the washing machine one and this came. But anyway, maybe I didn't know that I think of it, but I was, I was like, what? When I came, but anyway, I don't even know. Like, oh, my brain is just so scattered at the moment. I don't know what I'm like. But anyway, they look good. Um, and they're meant to be good for your machine and to keep them a lot cleaner. So, um, the washing machine one targets hidden dirt, hygienically cleans, leaves a fresh scent so that your um, washing, machine, washing machine doesn't stink. I mean, mine has never stunk and I don't remember my parents were ever smelling either. And I don't know if they do this, but sure there's no harm in trying it i love dr beckman so much i don't even know how to pronounce it um so i thought they must be good so yeah you literally just pour it into the drum pretty much and then you have to do a main wash cycle i don't know what, what's the main wash one anyway at a minimum of 60 degrees without a pre-wash so i'll try that cycle or additional detergent and start the machine well my machine is full of um fabric conditioner but anyway, I'm not going to scoop that out like I'm just going to do it anyway. Uh, one treatment leaves machine hygien hygienically clean and fresh after cleaning the washing machine is ready to use. It says to use it every two months or every 30 cycles. So probably had mine had ours about nine months I'd say. So yeah, but anyway, it's true. It's fine. See if it makes a difference. It definitely, if it's gonna make a difference, it should make a difference if I have it for that long or if I haven't done it for that long to get me. And then this one is for the dishwasher, which is probably a bit more interesting to be honest, because like eliminates bad odors. Like it doesn't really smell bad though. I clean pretty much everything that I put in. I don't put like full on dishes that are full of food and stuff in. Um so it doesn't really smell, but I feel like oh I don't know. Dishwashers just really do creep me out because I get so nervous of stuff being dirty. So if they don't clean properly, I literally have a heart attack makes me feel so sick um like the thought of it i mean not like it not being clean enough make me feel physically sick and um, so yeah this one targets grease and residues hygienically cleans leaves a sparkling finish so we'll see if that makes a difference um how often are you going to use this every two months or every 30 cycles so the same so all you have to do is use the wipe to clean around the door seal and outside area of your dishwasher what are you doing with this dog he's literally trying to go in that corner there when my leg was here he has to be as close as he can at all times um, okay, avoiding printed areas okay random i uh, filled the detergent department with the powder it's working any excess on the bottom of the empty dishwasher do not load dishwasher hmm select a sandy washing machine minimum 60 degrees and start the cycle do not detergent after cleaning dishwasher. They're pretty much the same technique. Technique, and they're both only one treatment per box. I kind of remember how much this was because I threw out the receipt, but it wasn't much because I tried to work it out from the other stuff that I bought. I only spent like 18 euro, but I got loads of stuff, so it can't have been that much. So yeah, and I can't remember how much that was. Seven euro or something? Oh, I don't know. I probably got ripped off on this one, so don't even quote me. Ignore <laughs> the dryer in the background. But I also got this absolutely massive, massive, massive um, fabric conditioner for five euro and little yesterday. I love the spring awakening smell so much. It's probably my favourite. And I have the capsules that are also spring awakening, and then this too. Oh my god, it is the nicest combo in the whole world. And it's also really nice with this more adorable instead of the this one um but oh my god this smell is so nice i literally smell my clothes constantly when i've washed them with it that combo is the best got this in little as well ignore the dirty clothes in the background oh did i just pause that i don't even know if it's over anyways um it's so cute i'll show you quickly it's for bob because he sleeps out here so it's so cute i think it was five euro Shut up. Okay, now I'm onto the dishwasher. So it comes with a little wipe to do the bits that it tells you to do. And then you just put this in there. Bobby's very curious about it, aren't you? Good boy. 
But what the hell? Look how dirty that is after only doing like around the edge. Jesus. Red. Uh, Neem got a good day's work done, didn't he, Bob? a bit of weeding and stuff can't believe how much of a difference like one day work has done not even a full day it's just like half a day but it's so cute they're all really awesome so sad you i didn't know that you could watch full-on pillows until lately i was like to con do you think i could wash them because there's like full-on like drill marks on mine you know because like especially when you wear tan so yeah i'm gonna wash con's one today i washed mine the other day and it came out brand new so good you can just wash them and then dry them in the dryer <laughs> and they're done in like just a few hours it's so perfect contemplating doing them today but i'm also a bit nervous don't really want to um, but like i think they'll look really nice i think they'll be cute except um, oh, how perfect would it be if they just fit there perfectly because i think the tile up there is a bit smaller and all. i'm gonna have to like cut the bottom one but that'll be fine it's just a harder job it'll be grand I think they just stick on. It seems pretty easy to be honest. But like who knows if it actually is. But they look good, don't they? For like 30 euro for all of these. I don't know if it'll be enough though. I might have to buy another packet, that's the issue, but it will still surely be a lot cheaper than tiles. So you just have to wash it. First of all, you need to cut the jagged side of the tile first that's straight. It's okay. Um and then just overlap them. Okay, that seems okay. So let's hope it is. <laughs> I just don't know where to start. Like, do I start down here? Also, the tiles randomly go all the way up here. So I'm gonna have to do all the way up there now. But like, I just don't know if I should start up there and go down and then do this in that direction or if I should just start with the easy bit down here, you know? It's very tough. So I will leave a link to these down below in the description box. Um, they're also down there by the way. But yeah, also this is the thing that I was telling you about. It's just like, see that in the picture. So I just see it's just like basically frosted kind of for your window. Like how we have this butterfly one on the bathroom. But like, I'm just not really feeling the butterfly one, you know. So <laughs> I'm going to hopefully be able to change it to this. And there's loads of this, but we don't need it for anything else. So... But still it was like six seven years something like that so it's grand no, but i think i might just go for it i think i might just do like start over here at the edge and do like that part and then just keep going and i hope to god that they no they will match up because then it just goes up doesn't it that's not complicated at all i don't know why i made a big deal out of that in my head <laughs> and when we have that changed we've already painted in here i am um, i think i'm just gonna get ceramics paint and paint the toilet and sink because like I was thinking oh maybe we should just get new ones but I don't really think we're gonna get new ones soon so I'll paint them if they look shit it's a sign I'll just get new ones no harm surround the paint is like probably under 20 years worth a try and um, then I'm gonna get some sort of nice mirror for here I'm gonna probably leave that mirror I was contemplating painting it but I think we've too much black and stuff in here so I think I'm just gonna leave it that wooden -y kind of color it's not perfect but I've seen worse. Anyways, I'll leave that to last and see. Um, hmm, what else? Maybe I don't need that mirror, to be honest, actually. I don't know. We'll see anyways. This is kind of, I've cleaned it. It looks dirty, but I think it's just, it's stuck like that now. So maybe we'll eventually get rid of that as well. But I could do with another coat on the radiator because I needed one on that. But the rest of it has two coats. It's finished. Um, and then this is Bob's little room so I will paint in here and stuff like that too we haven't touched in here at all at all and then we have loads of gardening tools and stuff in there my dad got me this which is so gorgeous so I'm gonna like get a hook and hang that up out there I think on your way to the garden it'll be cute and also because it is um has like these two bits I think I'll do the top bit a different colour but it has to be something really subtle because it's right beside this green so I don't want like another colour or anything but it'll just be like a cream or something and then white on the bottom something like that so. I 
I definitely shouldn't use a scissors to cut these. Like, you probably should have a proper knife, or not knife, like blade, but whatever it's called. But, uh, like, I just can't bear to go look for them, to be honest. I'd say it'll be fine, because I can, like, line it up properly with it, the, because they're only small, but if you have a proper blade, maybe use it. They're so nice, though, aren't they? Okay, they're pretty thick and hard to cut through. If I at least get a ruler and pencil, it'll be better. Okay, I stopped being lazy and just got the actual cuts. So, I've got a pencil, a little blade, and this is the only ruler I could find, but it's grand, it's big enough. When I'm lonely in the dark like 180 euro or something which i feel like is so good for like a day of being on a roof <laughs> i wouldn't do that for all the money in the world but i'll show you that when it's done i was thinking oh i wish i got a before but you'll be able to see from the houses either side of us because i don't think either of them have got it done so you'll see the difference guys we've ran out of tiles okay so i have just one more thing to do but this is it so far how good do they look i'm sorry but they actually look so fucking good 
I think they look incredible. It was like 30 euro for those. I'm gonna have to buy another packet of the same. So it would be like 60 euro. Is that good? How much are tiles? I don't even know. But it definitely makes this room so much nicer, like modern -y. You know, oh, it, they look fucking great. I'm sorry. And they also took two days to come on Amazon. Now I do have Prime Bus. Yeah, they literally came two days later, even on a Saturday. So very impressed. I just have all of this boxy that I do. <laughs> but anyway, at least I don't have to do it now because I don't physically have any more. So it's good because I do need to get all this job done instead of just fucking sticking up fake tiles all day on a Monday morning. Like, what am I like? It's going. See ya. Guys, I just ordered these for seven euro from Amazon. So I'm gonna use these on, I think there's only actually two presses in the utility slash bathroom. But um, yeah, so I will, you get four, I'll use two on that. I think I'll put one on my like, oh, excuse me, on my dressing table um drawer. So then I might have one spare, but like that's grand and then, um yeah i don't need them anymore i've ordered okay then i also got some floor tiles as well for the bathroom stick on ones obviously um here they are so i don't know what they'll be but i have seen in person like fake ones of these tiles you know like the tiles with that pattern there's only 15 euro for 10 pieces which i'm hoping might be enough like i don't really know but i'll get the 10 and see if I actually even like them first and then get the others because they literally come on like two days anyway so it's no big deal like they're coming on Wednesday and today is Monday so it's grand and um, that's how thick they are but yeah that's what they look like so I'm pretty excited for those I think they'll be nice I hope they're not too much I've been hemming and hawing about them for a few days and then I just decided today when the other tiles went so well that like fuck it I'm gonna do it I'm gonna do it so I did it Mm, guys, I just made a really nice little coffee for myself using um, hazelnut syrup instead because my friend Eva told me it was really nice and I love it. I don't know if I've put enough in or not though, but I'm too scared to put two more in and ruin it, you know. But it's really nice and um, gorgeous. And yeah, I frothed up the milk and everything. I used an espresso machine. It's so nice. Oh, I love I rarely bother to make myself proper coffee and like froth the milk and everything but when I do I'm always like oh it just it's so much more of an experience <laughs> um but I also have a gingerbread one that I cannot wait to try and amaretto as well that would be delicious I've obviously tried the others I am finally taking up the curtains that we got on Ikea they're actually so nice so I can just look at them the quality is so nice and so good good boy Bob are you helping Oh, you're the best boy. Well, yeah, I need to take a lot off them. <laughs> I just got this on Amazon as well. So it was like 2 50 for all of that. Um, and you just literally put a bit of it in between and it bonds together so you don't have to sew it. Don't have to go get any sewing machine out or sit in their hand sewing. It's so much quicker and easier. My mom got one like this in Ikea when she bought curtains and she said it was so much handier. So I'm just going to use that. It'll be absolutely grand. So more of these and these also came. They look so good. Proper hard like tiles. These, these are like rubber nearly but they look good so who cares. New handles. Need to order another packet of this. Good boy. Come on, let me pass. Good morning guys, it is now the next morning. I just got to work a while ago, it's 8 o'clock. I'm gonna do some more tiling. I showed you these quickly yesterday, but I will show you now in a bit more detail. Let me just turn this on a few bits to show you too. So, yesterday, Con came home and I got him on board with the bathroom transformation. So, uh, he put these on. I got them on Amazon, I love them. They're not like shiny gold, they're like brushed kind of. Love them. So I think they make bit of a difference, a bit more exciting, a bit more glamorous, you know. Um, there's no other girl in here though, so it's kind of a bit random, but, well, maybe I should have done silver, but I don't know why gold just, it's more glamorous for handles really, I feel like, I don't know. Anyway, it's done now, so 
Maybe I'll try find a little something that's girl that's a dog eating in the background, by the way, in case you're like, what the fuck is that noise? Um, so yeah, as you know, I've done some of these now. I'm worried that I will not have enough to do all of up here as well. And I'm like, I wish that they weren't there because they're just random AF. So like if one packet did that amount, the second packet is only going to have enough to do that amount in a tiny bit. And then I'm going to have to pay 30 euro for another packet. So oh, I don't know, but then taking down tiles like what will be behind them will it be such a mess will it need to be like replastered then again it looks shit up there anyway so i don't know i'm not sure what to do so i think i will start with the bit down here and then decide <laughs> i don't know also i'm going to do the floor ones as well i haven't got all of them i need more to come they're coming tomorrow so i think i'll just do them now anyways um like just the ones that i have i'm only short like five or six i think but they're so nice i love these and the floor in here is shit like look hey like it's ruined it's just it's shit it's so dirty like that's a stain you know so i'm just gonna close the toilet uh i also need some black paint to paint this i'm contemplating getting the ceramics paint to paint the toilet and the sink but then i'm also like will i just wait and get new ones when we can afford them but then i'm like will i ever be able to oh i don't know anyway i'm unsure about them but they're horrible but hello yeah can also put these up i got these on amazon and um, the towel wrap and the oh jesus oh jesus um toilet roll holder and then there's also another little hook that i'm undecided whether to do it here for another one of these or not but i'll wait i'll have to put up the rest of the tiles first or else i can hang it up like out here and hang like garden this on it or something but i feel like I don't know see that's quite cute but um yeah i'm undecided about that one so we haven't done it yet but yeah i think that's all the updates for the moment of progress guys i just looked out the window and bob was doing a wee he went out the back door without me getting him to go out on his own which he does not do and just he was just weeing on his own he didn't do it inside he did it outside on his own all on his own he's fully learning guys he's learning Oh, he gets it. He actually finally gets it. Oh, I love him so much. You're a good boy. Um, but look cute. What do you think, guys? Oh, I think they're going to make it. Just in here as well. I'm not going to do right there. I think just because it's a small little bathroom, it won't be too much. I think it'll be nice. Sure, we may as well. <laughs> These are super easy. He literally just pulled back off and they're like sticky underneath. So good. I just hope because they're a lot harder, I hope that they're easy enough to cut. You see anything, so we'll have to cut a few, but sure look, we'll cross that bridge <laughs> in five minutes when I have to deal with it all. <laughs> okay guys, I've only got one tile left. This one. Will I do an easy one or will I do a tough one that I have to cut around? Oh, so when you have to cut them that it really takes time, you know. It's tough. It's literally delivery day. I've got so many deliveries. This is this week's Healthy Cave. Uh, I'll open that in a second. Then I got this from Appy Vita. Hope I pronounced that right. Um, oh my god, guys. Is this the first Christmas package that I've got? I think so. Wow. And the box. Is this like a Christmas gift idea? But oh my god, these are so nice. I have another few little like bath type stuff from them, and they're such a vibe. I love the like brown and black type of stuff, you know me. They go really nicely with my bathroom. Um and then this is Happy Hands and Merry Kiss. So a lip balm and a hand cream. So yeah, I'm gonna open them now and show you the box or show you the like bottles properly. Here they are, hey you. This is body milk shower gel and then this is the hand cream and the lip balm oh, they're so cute i think the packaging is so nice of everything and they're available in pharmacies everywhere pretty much here or else from cosmeticsonline.ie so then next is greenheart cbd they sent me out my favorite one which is the rapeseed blend of oil uh they all they just have the same cbd but in different oils if you get me um, and I think I like this one the best. They're all great though. So yeah, this is it. And just a little top up because I'm literally nearly finished. These are the ones that they gave me. I love it so much. 
Um, and then I have a code, it's Emma Doyle 10 for, or Emma Doyle 20 for 20% off. Okay, so in this week's healthy cake, we have a chicken Caesar salad. I've had this before. It looks nice. Oh, I might have this for lunch. I loved it the last time. Chicken curry and rice had this last time. So nice. Chicken and smoked bacon penne. I'm not gonna even try penne sour fat arabiata. Um, looks phenomenal. Oh, I love pasta so much. This looks so good. Um, Chinese barbecue chicken and noodles. Wow. See, now I'm spoiled for choice because I would die for any of them for lunch. I'm also really hungry by now. It's nearly two, so of course I'll be able to decide to even with the dog. He's playing with the rapper. He's loving his life. <laughs> He's more excited than me. Than me. Um, Kinder Cave Bites. Oh my god, I haven't tried Kinder ones, but I've tried their other flavours and they're fucking insane. So I cannot wait to try them. And then a blueberry and chia cave box. This is such a handy little breakfast. It's like overnight egg. It's kind of. This looks and smells insane. Wow. This is the end of one of the kinder things. Actually, I only had half just to try it. Oh my god, it's so nice. Right, so now I've got my cup of coffee and I am gonna. Don't mind them. I'm waiting for the second um, packet to arrive tomorrow and then I'll finish them. Hi, you cutie. Um, but oh, let me turn on the light. I'm going to do some more of these wall tiles now because I should just, I hate myself or something. No, I actually kind of enjoy doing them. It's like a little puzzle kind of. It's, it's quite enjoyable. I do love it. What the hell is this? There's four of them here. Anyway, yeah, we're getting here. Don't have enough for up here. Sobbing. Trying to do the window for the next one, I'm a bit nervous. Okay, so the new stuff is up. I know it looks messy, but there's actually paint on the other side of the window. So ignore that, it actually is fine on this side. Um, but yeah, it's much nicer, much plainer. I'm gonna put the stuff back up on it again. I wish we could leave it not, with nothing on it, because it's much brighter, but it's just meh. Like if we have people over and we're all out in the garden, someone comes into the bathroom, it's kind of annoying. So no, I'd rather just have it there, but Anyway, it wasn't actually too difficult at all. I put it off because I was dreading it and look how much I've left as well. <laughs> ah, yeah. Oh, well. Looks nicer. It's so much nicer than the butterfly thing that we had anyway. <laughs> much better. Hey, guys. The rest of the tiles came, so I'll either put them down later on or tomorrow. And then we'll definitely see a massive improvement because, you know, it's a bit mis mismatched at the moment. But, yeah. And then I just need to order these when I get a chance and finish off that. A couple little things as well that I want to do as well, but we're definitely seeing an improvement. You know, you can notice a difference. This actually looks really good. I just need to get some white spirits and get the paint off the outside so you can see it up here. It's so annoying, like who actually painted that? But actually, it needs another paint anyway because I feel like the of it. So I think I need to do all those little things, like painting the little things that need it. You know that kind of way. Uh, and like in here and stuff. I want to paint in here too. Look in that corner. You know. And yeah, the little things will definitely make a way bigger difference. Like how dusty is that lamp? I haven't cleaned it at all since I've been here and they probably didn't clean it for a long time either. So I love that for me. And this light's just in the bathroom, it's a bit meh. If I see a nicer one, I will get it. We haven't got any new lights yet, so there already will probably be like the kitchen and sitting room, but anyway, that's just dry or some laundry that needs to be dried and then i need to go over a few things i needed one coat on this radiator because the plumber was coming the day that i did it and i forgot so it was like shit so then i just did one really light one so that it would be dry by the time we got here so i need to do that and then i put other things that i need to fix up but yeah it's getting there